Compromise may be a bit of a dirty word these days, especially in Washington, with just one week left before the sequester takes effect, cutting government spending. Well, this week, Lou's been thinking about deal making. Here's author and educator Lou Heckler. As we witness the give and take in Washington, D.C. these days, I'm reminded of an article I read recently in the Washington Post about the actor Dustin Hoffman. After acting for so many years, he has directed his first film. It's called Quartet. In the article, he talked a lot about how that side of the camera taught him an awful lot about compromise. He is a talented and exacting performer who has wowed us in films like The Graduate and Tootsie and Rain Man. But now as a director, he had to make a lot of people happy, and that takes a talent for compromise. I talk to a lot of mid-level managers in my business, and they tell me that many younger people need some training in this area. Let's face it, we've often made compromise a dirty word. It, it seems to mean giving in, or worse, giving up. But the dictionary says it can also mean to agree, to reach an accord. Business writer Tom Peters talks about great companies having loose, tight principles. Tight commitments to purpose and performance, but loose, as in willing to adjust, when it comes to execution. I know it's tough, but two good questions to ponder this week are, where do I need to be just a little less rigid and still get the job done? And where do I need to compromise? I'm Lou Heckler.